Oh, sorry. Sorry. I still didn't know how to say that right. I apologize. Hello. Who's here for the first time? I can't see you. So there you go. Welcome. I have to tell you a housekeeping item that you guys have to do. I'm afraid of the microphone. Hello. If you have a cell phone, please put it on silent, but take tons of photos and hashtag Timakua Arts and whatever else you want to hashtag, just share it everywhere. We want everyone to know and to come and be a part of our evening here. Um, if you have a wine glass, please use it for the entire evening and then bring it to the kitchen when you're done and that way I can put it away. Uh, thank you for bringing food. Thank you for sharing. If you need to use a restroom, there are three, one on each corner on the left-hand side of every floor. Um, there's an exit here. There's an exit over there if it's like a complete emergency. If you're blocking the exit, I can't see back there. Let's just open it up. But other than that, please go that way. Uh, the artists have amazing CDs because they're amazing. And they have amazing t-shirts. Everyone needs these. We have, what, Mother's Day coming? Father's Day? I don't know. Something. <laughs> Mother's Day and Father's Day coming. Yeah, Father's Day. What? Oh, my gosh. My dad would love that. If I had a dad. Um, we also have a bowl. We would love for everyone to share how much they love it in a financial manner just to help us get through. And Because this is all volunteer in the uh, living room of Benoit and Elaine, who are not here. Hi. They're traveling. They're, we're on camera, so wave. Everybody wave at Elaine. And is that everything? Yep, you're the only guest. Okay. And then I'm going to introduce you to Chris. He is the director of the foundation, and he's going to tell you everything that you need to know about anything. Welcome, Chris. Hello, I'm Chris Belt, Executive Director of Timakua Arts Foundation. Thank you so much for being here. This is part of our Sunday night concert series. We've had over 730 concerts here. Yeah, it's very special. Thank you. So if it's your first time here, you should know that we do our Sunday night concert series. These are always by donation. You're not obligated to uh, join any list or you know a secret society or anything bring your friends Sunday nights you know we're pretty much always gonna have something going on on Sunday nights we also have ticketed events about once a month we do some like very special extremely high-level touring artists so the next one uh, actually this one isn't even ticketed this is just for the world um, Norwegian jazz ensemble Paul Nilsson love large unit on June 12th it's like extremely high-level stuff um, I'll go ahead and say mind-blowing. So if you want to have your mind blown, if you're thinking like, ah, my mind has not been blown lately, uh, that would be a date to mark in your calendar. So uh, please join our email list. You can also become a member. We have a bunch of members here tonight. Please, members, raise your hand. So these people think that it's worth it to give us a little bit of extra support. Thank you very much. Um, and they pay for us to be able to do all these amazing things that we do. So we really appreciate our members. Wendy has a question. Members get to come in early at all of our events. They also save on ticketed events, so you get 50% off every ticket you buy for a ticketed show. We also do um, special members only receptions, um, and you just won't get invited to those unless you're a member. And we also have an annual gala, which just started last year, where we do the absolute highest level thing we can possibly do. So if you're interested in any of those things, please talk to me. I'm going to introduce Boris. He is the director or uh, chair of visual arts for our programming committee, and Boris is going to tell us about our art for the evening. So thank you, Boris. Thank you, Chris. Uh, tonight, it's a great honor. It, tonight feels like Hollywood film day because I'm standing next to Jean, uh, I'm sorry, Omens, yeah, I'm remembering everything, who is through his father, kind of connected to Hollywood film royalty because your father is a well-known cinematographer who is Oscar nominated, been in a lot of famous films, but so is this guy. This guy is known for uh, creating special effects makeup for many important films that you've seen. He's also important as having created uh, major changes in the video gaming industry, but tonight you're gonna see him as a sculptor as a sculptor. So my favorite story about him is the artist Frank Zappa. He wrote an off-Broadway play called Thinkfish. Thinkfish, and he commissioned him 
to create the special effects, the makeup for the main characters, and it was so fantastic that they used an image on the cover of the album, right? Absolutely. And so, and so the, the actor, the, the, the main guitarist, uh, Ike Willis, wore the suit. Uh, he performed the, the, uh, his, all his dialogue, all his uh, mu music for that, for that Broadway. It was, it was awesome to be able to go during one of their rehearsals, and Frank has a huge band. I mean, it's like 16 pieces. And he filled the soundstage, and I walk in, and I hear them playing. And it is the tightest group that you could ever possibly want to hear. I mean, you have to love Frank Zappa's music. Not everybody does. <laughs> but I respect him as a musician, and, and for what he did, he, he spoke his mind. And uh, I, I'm forever grateful to be a part of that, uh, to be able to produce that for him. So. And Gene has three works of art in the lobby. One of them is of a horse, and it's called Elegance in Motion, and it's 3,000. There is one for the Post Memorial called Love Release, and that's 5,000. And then there is one of a, of a man asking why, and that is 3,000. But tell us a little bit about the Pulse one. Year, you know, two years ago, we had the tragedy of the, of the Pulse. And at the Palachik Museum, there was an exhibition called uh, Summer of Love, Reflection on Pulse. And uh, I prepared this piece specifically for that show. And it is about grieving. It's about letting go. The figure that's underneath is in his last kiss saying goodbye to the spirit of the loved one. And that's what I tried to capture in this piece. Um, I always try to, I want to invoke an emotion in all of you. Um, without that, I feel that my art would be dead and it, it has no life. So I like hearing what people get from the piece because I create it one way, but what do you all see? That's what gets me excited. That's what keeps me wanting to do more art for all of you. Big round of applause. <laughs> Before I go, I wanted to say that Timucua is a donations-based foundation. Uh, Timucua is the jewel and the crown of the Orlando art scene. People like Wendy and Chris and Beatrice and, of course, the founders have done so much for Orlando. Please donate generously tonight. Thank you. Can you hear the 
Keep it going. This is a song off our new album called Crusader. We haven't released it yet, but uh, you guys will be one of the few to hear it for, well, one of the first plays we've got. So. I think with that, we'll keep it on the album, if that's all right with y'all. Yeah. Yeah, sometimes you just need a song that just kind of um, kind of brings people together. There's been a lot of just division in our world lately. I don't know if you all have experienced that. A um, lot, of, lot, lot of stuff floating around in the air, but I think, I think there's a deeper thing going on, and we just all need to stick together. Speaking of sticking together... Um, got some good news about our friends Jason and Jenny. This uh, song we wrote for them for their wedding um, is called Jenny, which, uh, which is great. Um, wrote it for their wedding, but um, finished it just in time for their um, seventh wedding anniversary. <laughs> um, yeah. That joke so, never gets old. Yeah, <laughs> it really doesn't. They're still together. And uh, so 
this is still a good song. I, I hope you guys enjoy it. It's on the album, actually, that's out there. So if you guys are liking what you're hearing tonight, we got some, uh, we got some live stuff and, uh, and uh, our previous EP for sale out there. Um, as Wendy mentioned earlier, thanks, Wendy, so much for mentioning that and the cool Kelpie t-shirts. This song called Jenny. Just got started I know That you and I just met They say It left you broken hearted I say The best is to come yet So Sun's over here And she 
all so much. Uh, well, I'll introduce the band really quick while we take a quick tune-up break. Um, over to my far right Close and enough. your left, that's Matt Giuliano on what we call the okay. tiny guitar. For those not in the know, it's actually called a mandolin and we, we rather enjoy that. Eight strings, Matt? Eight strings? 22. All right, so 22. we'll take a move. Uh, over here, slapping the bass over here, Mr. Tony Mickle. And also in dual guitar mode tonight, um, before you saw him, we saw, we call it the, the shiny, I'm sorry. See, I ruined the joke already. We call it the tiny guitar. Tiny. And this guy plays the shiny guitar, which you can see right there. Shiny. Yeah. Ah, I'm all joked out tonight, man. Um, but this is Sean Patrick Quinn, probably the most Hello, Irish Sean. person you've ever met. Hey. And last but not least, back here slapping the skins, which is, is that what you call that, JB? What do you call that? Well, you know what? That's a drum kit now. It's a drum kit now. And, uh, I don't call know. It a drum what kit. do you call it, Dan? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. And you are? Who are you? My name is Dan, and I'm so happy to be here. Uh, and my mom is watching from Hi, Ohio mom. right now online. So let's hear it. Hey. Hi, Mom! Hey, Ohio! <laughs> We're streaming. This is another song off our upcoming album, and this is um, this is pretty uh, deep and meaningful to to me, and well, I think to all of us. Uh, we we're pretty tight with our families at home, and um, this one specifically is about kind of like wanting to pass, um, drop the bad stuff and pass the good stuff on to the kids, you know, as they move forward. And um, this one's called February Morning. Back weeks 
so much. I think my son Wesley would really appreciate it. You guys applauded that. That's, that's really great. Thank you. There's another one off our new album. I don't think we've played this one out very much at all. So This is called Play Clay, but you guys are privileged. 
What? Wow, that's, that's pretty bold of me to say, isn't it? It is now, right? Wow, that just came out like that. Well, oh, damn. The bar's been raised, gentlemen.
since we're all better now I heard that he took off when you said how how much you loved him it's just too bad you're not together now Sounds like a lot of folks that can resonate with a little bit of heartbreak. Um, that was written by Matt and a friend who, uh, friend Matt, Matt Tonner. Two Matt, actually. Two Matt. Two Matt. Matt Squared wrote that song, and yeah, it's about uh, it's about dealing with uh, some sudden breakup stuff. And speaking of that, I think um, let's do another one like that, shall we? Oh, <laughs> sounds great. Let's keep it rolling. <laughs>
according to the temperature of the room. How are you guys feeling? You feeling good? All right, good. Oh, wow, this, this place is amazing. Um, thanks again to Tim McQuaw for having us, Wendy for hooking this up, and the Glazers for opening up their home like this. Um, incredible venue. This is a lot, um, a lot different than the venues where we end up playing. We play a lot of festivals, um, although we play a lot of places where the store, uh, floors are a lot stickier than this, so we appreciate... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, see the jokes keep coming. The jokes are <laughs> they, keep gonna, rolling, they keep on rolling. Right? They, they just keep, keep rolling. on rolling. That's, a, that's my cue, right? That's your cue, man. That song, um, we, uh, it's about kind of um, just experiencing loss. And, um, and a couple years ago, we, we just finished the EP, and then not too far after that, um, the, the Pulse tragedy uh, happened and um, made a little video just that kind of um, took a lot of the, the, the pouring out of the community that happened um, in that time. And that's something that you can look at on, on, on YouTube. But, um, but that one to us just kind of, Every time we play it, it kind of reminds reminds us of that of that time and just sort of the, uh, the community kind of going through some dark times, but also uh, the, on the other side of that, despite tragedy, um, again, like I got a message from earlier, just that we can all kind of rise from those ashes and, and, and move forward um, even bigger and better and stronger um, as a result. Yeah. 
the um, the uh, one thing I'm kind of wondering. Um, we're gonna we're gonna play another song. Uh, I feel like I just kind of brought the mood down quite a bit. Way to go, um, man! And uh, well, there you go, there you go. Now we're gonna bring it back up again. And what I'm really curious about, Gene, Gene, how does this affect like how you sculpt? I'm curious. Ooh, the different good moods and all that. How does this does this like uh, play into it at all? The moods of the songs that kind of affect how you're what you're. <laughs> no, well, okay. Is it, right. is it like right. Super Mario Brothers? If we stop and then play faster, you'll do, go twice as fast. Oh, <laughs> let's try that. Let's try that. All right, it's time for some metal. All right, all right. Well, this is a toe tapper, and uh, it's one where I'm not going to sing on. It's uh, it's I don't know. It's kind of a mixture of. It's a strange song. Yeah, it's it's kind of a mixture of uh, Greek and Irish. Sure. I'm gonna throw something else out there. We'll try yeah, to work that too, into. Right. There's an Irish guy over there. So. Oh, 
again um we got more songs off the new album coming out uh, tonight okay if, if that's all right with y'all um, yeah, yeah. this one we really treasure um it's about tony treasuring something that never really came through is that right tony mm, yeah that's a loaded question yeah it is yes yeah, it is. To tell, <laughs> no. him, tell him a little bit about it. you got a car or you, you well, i didn't get a car so you let's didn't just look get at a it. car so, yeah uh, my grandfather had a really fast car so fast that none of the grandkids were allowed to drive it <clears throat> so and then uh since i wasn't allowed and brothers weren't allowed, it just sat there and rusted out. So long story short, I didn't get the car. So I wrote a song around it, so yeah. I wrote a song about it. Yeah. Like you do. It was a cool car too, man. That thing was fast. It, it had no seat belts. <laughs> it was a Chevy Nova. It was a Nova, which is, which in this case is kind of funny because Nova in Spanish means doesn't go and you never got to go in the car. But Another joke! That's not a joke.
but for speaking not to let It got donated to a high school. Like, so I called my aunt later, and she's like, oh, we donated it to the high school. I'm like, you donated to the high school? What? And so, and then they fixed it up, and... He's not bitter at all. No, He's not, not at all. Not, not at all. Not one bit. Not one Me bit. and my cousin joke about it, too. It's pretty funny. Hey, Jeremy. Streaming live. Streaming live to Jeremy right now. <laughs> you, gotta, <laughs> you know, and in that same vein, so we got a car that didn't go, and then oh. uh, the song we like to also dedicate to I4. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, it's a, so it's automotive and heartbreak. Yeah, right? it's the, well, so. heartbreak, automotive, and uh, this one's called Barricade. So we, de we, de we dedicate this one to I4. <laughs> Either that or we dedicate it to Bob. <laughs> dedicated to all my peeps back in Ohio. Uh, Wait. Anybody here from Ohio? Oh. Are you kidding me? No way. Wow. This is that was you. I was not expecting that at all. Uh, it's like, are you guys, are you guys for real? Okay. Do you live here permanently now? Cleveland. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh. Did you guys stack the deck with this room tonight or what? Apparently. This is crazy. All right. All right. All right. Well, I'm not going to Raise your hands if you're still living down here. Okay, okay. 
I, I, lo I lived in a small town called Wapakoneta. Anybody familiar with Wapakoneta? You know where that is? Holy cow. I don't okay. even know where that is, man. Yeah, yeah. Uh, shoveling snow and all that stuff. I know when I was a kid, um, so I drove around town all the time and just could not wait to kind of see the big city lights and uh, end up in the metropolis of Orlando. You know, how you do? So this song is uh, kind of about my buddy and I, I chat. We would drive around town and just kind of dream about finding something new and different. And uh, it's called Busted Out. You want to know, the, know what the lyrics are about? I mean, would you like that? That yeah. All right. All right. Cool. Cool. So we used to spend like what little we had on uh, 95, <laughs> 95 cent, two liters of Moon Mist. You guys familiar with Moon Mist? It's not, it's not quite Mountain Dew, it's, uh, it's the uh, generic version of Mountain Dew. And we do that in pizzas on Friday night, so first verse, are you ready for this? 95 cents in my pocket again Driving around town and finding a friend I couldn't open notice what's on the radio Never heard a song, and I felt so alone. I guess I'm gonna go my third round again, third time around again, and I don't know this song. Hey! You want it, you need it to see. Chad and I, we would drive around town in this, uh, I think it was a Chevelle. It was a red beat up old car, but, um, so, him and that buddy, uh, Jason, that I told you about earlier, they got married to Jenny. They, uh, they took a PA speaker out of one of the boys' uh, restrooms, and we, we went ahead and hooked that up to the stereo in Chad's car, and it, uh, caught on fire in the back of the car. You guys know there's a deeper meaning to the fire in your heart in this uh, in this song. Back of the old car, the speakers burning, the fire is burning, a heart again. A tone between two. Times I wonder, hell I wonder, back again. You want it, you need it to see your name in lights. The silence is killing. It's time. never knew any of that. I, I didn't know. Yeah, there's some details in there I did not know. This is like storytellers tonight, like man. This I like is it awesome. a lot. This I like fun. it. <laughs> J 
check my tuning. That's what I'm going to do. Matt's going to... Thank you, Matt, for being honest with good me. Good job, Matt. That. You guys are still having a good time, right? Right? Okay, okay. all right. Just checking. Just well, checking. We, we got a few more songs on this, if that's okay with y'all. Is that right? All right. Yeah, cool. it's okay. All right. And I would, I would suggest for the last few that we're going to play tonight, I would suggest if you don't have a full wine glass, <laughs> um, you might want to have one. You might want to have one for the, for, the, for the last few, especially for the last one um, we play. We, we got kind of a tradition going where at the last song of every set, um, we, uh, we kind of have a, an Irish drinking song. So if you're not, if you're not there, I would, I would get there. Oh, <laughs> Way there to go, there, Dan. There you go, there you go. Way to go. Way to go, Dan. Thanks a lot. Yeah. What have you done? They bum rush the bar and lo and lock the door too. Okay, lock, don't right, let anybody right. out. Are they gone? Yeah, I really hope the guy in the bar heard the bar's me say like, that. What are you doing? Like, What's happening right now? <laughs> Good night, nurse. It's like a fire sale. <laughs> Did I say Laurel or Yanni? I don't. Yanni. It's Yanni. Say. It's Yanni. You know what's really bad about this right now? I've made it worse with my tuning right now. I've Way just go, made dude. it so much worse with my Fix tuning. Fix it, dear Eliza. Fix it. <laughs> and while you're out there, we also have t-shirts. <laughs> <laughs> we push the merch, man. And, uh, push the merch. Push the merch. Push the merch. There's, Kel there's a Kelpie shirt out there for there's somebody. There's a Kelpie shirt out there. There's, uh, Well, if it's not perfectly in tune, then we're just going to cover over it with some really cool dancing. Tony's a good dancer. Am I right? Am I, I right? Let's hear for Tony you and his can't dancing. Stop me.
Say three more. Me <laughs> three more. We'll do a couple more. That's that's cool. Is that right with y'all? Is, is that good? All right. Just want to make sure you guys are having a good time. I mean, we got to check in on that. I don't know if we can do that. But also, I want to just make sure that. Uh, and 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 Gene, how you doing, man? Doing. He's doing awesome. Look at that. Look at that. We got a full head of hair there going on. <laughs> uh, let's do guys. Let's do backseat. You want to do backseat? Okay. That's a, that's a fun one. If you feel like getting up and dancing, um, then you're more than welcome to. Is that, is that right, Wendy? Is that dancing? Wendy's, Wendy's actually a prime example of dancing here while you're here at the White House. Now, I can't tell you what this one's about because uh, there are little ears in the audience. But we're just going to call it. We'll figure it out. It's hard to get moving when you don't know where you're going. Motivation. Back and when you're standing still I don't want to fight We're right there on the highway Know what I want to hear right now Know what I want to hear Turn the band
so many songs. I know, I was expecting more myself. I know, I know. I'm like, are there anything else? Are we going to do one song that's not ours? That's okay, but but we're going to do it our way, if that's all right with y'all. Is that all right? And it's, yeah, we're going to make it ours tonight, all right? And we'll make it yours too, because this is a sing along then. And then I need to hear all the voices in the room go, I.
Thank you so much. Uh, our name is Bimo. We'll be. Oh man. Got quiet really quick. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. This one's for the Gipper, man. Can you do it back there? Bimo. Bimo. Okay. So, so this. All right. We'll play one more song. That's cool with y'all. And Sean's got an amazing, amazing. Well. It's really like five songs in one, um, and if you guys know if you guys know any any cool new dance moves, you can do that. Oh, what's that? What are you thinking? What are you thinking? You gonna do Bimo or Take on Me? Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. So, well, that that kind of ruins the surprise. Yeah, but said you didn't hear that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you didn't hear that. You didn't hear that whatsoever. Yeah, like whatsoever. Watermelon. Water. Um, but thank you guys so much. You guys have been amazing. Give yourselves a hand for just giving us the, the, the floor to like, just attempt to entertain such an amazing crowd like you guys. And, um, and thank you to the White House for, and um, the Timical Arts Foundation and all of the, all the members here um, who support arts in this community. I mean, really, thank you so much for keeping things alive. Give yourselves a hand for that. Um, I, I still can't get it. We still can't get over just what a special place this really is. So thank you for keeping it going, keeping it alive. And um, again, we're just super grateful um, to have been a part of your evening and uh, just, a, just a, a glimmer in the, in the eye of the arts community here in Orlando. So uh, this one's for you. Whoever requested it, um, thank you. Thank you for that. And uh, oh, I heard that. There you go. <laughs> hey, how you doing? i 
You guys have been amazing. Um, our name is BMO, and we're gonna be right out here. Uh, you got any, you got any wine left? You got uh, wine? You got wine left? We're gonna be out here. Uh, if you guys are interested in CDs and all that good stuff, we'll be right out here to give you hugs and. <laughs> we don't want to kill the drummer, so let's. Uh, he likes hugs though, and so does this guy right here in the black shirt. He loves hugs, so be sure to give him a nice big hug. No, he does. No, he does not. <laughs> but thanks again, That's the guys. Joke. <laughs> this one's a live one, and then the one with the little sunshine on it is a is a studio uh, EP. And we would love to also. Um, do we do we have an email list going? Do we? We do. Good. Awesome. We would love to hear from you guys again. We'd love to tell you when the full length album's coming out, um, which is very very soon. We'd love to. Just keep in touch with you guys. So good night. Thank you so much.